Here we have the parts of the valve laid out so they're easier to see. Beginning at the top, here we have the stopper arm retaining screw. Here's the stopper arm. Here we have the hoof eisen and the screws which hold it in position. The hoof eisen is the part, portion which holds the bumpers in place. Here we have the valve casing. Here's the valve itself. Here's the back bearing plate. Here's the back cap. Now, let's have a closer look at the valve and the important parts of the valve. Here we have the back or bottom post. Here we have the bottom bearing surface. These are the surfaces which actually make contact when the valve is assembled, and these are the surfaces that need the oil. The sides of the valve here do not contact and should not need oil. Here we have the top post and the top bearing surface. Now, there is a matching bearing on the bottom plate, bottom bearing plate, as you see here, the bottom bearing. And then also in the valve itself, in the valve casing. And you can see in here on this valve, which is out of an instrument, very cleanly. Here's the bearing surface. So here are the parts of the valve as we need to know them. Mm -hmm.